wander with us for part three of the 2023 Tampa RV Super Show. Hi everybody, this is Miko and Robin and we're Wander, Wander Open, Open Roads. Roads. Let's wrap up this video series with some Jayco and Integra motorhomes. Okay, we have an Elante by Jayco. So we got a ladder on the back, which I like. Big awning all the way down the side. Slam mask compartments. Hey babe, we might have an outdoor kitchen here. Oh. Take a look here. In the back. Yep. And we have an outdoor kitchen, a refrigerator. It's like a slide out drawer for a grill or a griddle of some sort. And you have a sink. Very nice. Outdoor TV. Nice. Take a quick look. So, outdoor kitchen oh, and outdoor locked. TV? Yep, outdoor kitchen and TV. So, that is okay. the bonus. Uh, this is a 29S. With some of the, okay. Oh, yeah, that's. The batteries okay. and that's all like the, and the such. Dual battery bank. Is that, was that two or four? What am I looking at? Uh, I just see two, but it looks like room for four. And there's your LP tank. Ooh, not slam latch. <laughs> My bad, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, open that one. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, yeah. Nice. Big, deep. Oh, yeah. And this goes all the way to the other side. I love oh, those. Oh, nice. Yeah. It's always nice to have at least one of those type of compartments. Yes. This is a Model 29S. It is a Ford V8. Uh, and let's uh, take a look on the inside. brown thing going on here theater seating which is nice and uh, let's see we have our dinette there's a TV over in the corner looks like your uh, liquid bed come down into your interior cabin area it's kind of look at that, that dashboard it's kind of kind of different kind of a full see that yeah, yeah kind, of, kind of neat almost almost feels like a like a car the way that dash goes all the way across it's kind of neat mm-hmm it's different yeah okay all right so here is the kitchen area all right or for the bedroom and the bathroom. Okay. Yep. Furion cooktop and oven. Microwave. Okay, that's a RV refrigerator. Looks like we have a, a pull out. Oh, not a look like sliding drawers, but yeah. Nice deep pantry. There. This is nice. Yeah, this is just a regular kind of barn door here. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Yeah, that is yeah, cute. I like the barn doors. <laughs> nice bathroom. Yeah. Yeah. This is your Lots of cabinet space. Your basic like two door. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Basic refrigerator. Two door RV refrigerator. Mm-hmm. And the bedroom. Okay, we are looking at a Precept. So this is a Jayco Precept, sale price $159, Class A. This is a Model 36A. Got a slide out there, have a big TV right here on the outside. Some nice compartment storage. That's what we like on the Class A's. And there's your awning. Let's go inside. and spacious definitely like this uh yeah this front this front cab i like this you know it has kind of, kind of a different feel to it um 
could use kind of a bigger screen there that's your navigation screen I'd like for that to be a little bigger but yeah still looks pretty nice there's your your bed that will slide down that is your TV kind of right here in the middle of the kitchen area once again you might uh, might bump your head while you're washing dishes there with the TV or <laughs> you have to will be in the way move your head out of the way for the cannot person. multitask do <laughs> dishes yeah. and watch TV right so there's your sofa it is not theater seating uh, you have a dinette uh, looks like a <laughs> that looks like the same refrigerator we have at home right, so I'll definitely call that a residential fridge uh, this actually is a bunkhouse model and um, Here's your bathroom. And the master suite in the back. 32 inch TV with your wardrobes. Oh, and this. Bath this, and yeah, half. Yeah, this is, this is a bath and a half. This is a bath and a half. So this is the master bath. Ample cabinet space and a nice shower All right. okay we're looking at one last precept this is jaco precept sale price 174,995 list at 243 this is a model 36u nice paint job here on the outside now this has kind of the really big uh compartments here yeah. I mean, for the price we're looking at, I mean, these these compartments look like what you would find on the big diesel pushers. So I'm definitely, definitely liking these uh, compartments. This is the Preset Prestige. So this looks like they're probably their top of the line. Prestige uh, Preset model. Nice back cap, ladder going up the back there. Nice looking coach, yeah, nice looking coach. So this is going to um, definitely compare with uh, the Thor that we were looking at earlier. Yeah, that's a, that's a big outdoor TV right there, look at that. Big outdoor TV. Let's go inside. Well, hey Miko. Hello, welcome to the Jayco Precept. <laughs> okay. So, first thing I see that I do not like is, look at that carpet. What? Whoa. Why would they put carpet there? I'm not yeah. a fan. Not a fan. Okay. So here, this is a nice looking couch. Uh, I guess, oh, it's interesting. The, the middle seat, look at the middle, how the middle seat comes down with cup holders. And, oh, look at that. Cup holders and USB. Oh, nice. Yeah. Now that's that's that pretty sweet. That is neat. That is really neat. And these look to be recliners also. Um, mm -hmm. Yep. So you have recliners on the ends. You have the seat in the middle that'll fold down. Here's your dinette. Mm, these don't appear to come out. Okay. Now this dinette uh, is that. I assume that that is one that also forms into a bed, probably. I would assume. Yeah. Plus, you have the Euro Loft, of course, electric bed here up front. These pretty much look similar, although that that Pioneer that that is an upgraded screen there for your GPS in the front. Here is your kitchen area. Oh, I like that nice big refrigerator. Yeah, big refrigerator, uh, residential refrigerator with an induction cooktop. Yeah, that's nice. Furion induction cooktop with a convection microwave. There is no oven, but of course mm -hmm. that does give you additional cabinet space here at the bottom. Um, Definite yeah, residential oh yeah, that's refrigerator. A, yeah, that's a full size residential refrigerator. So. Yeah. With, with an ice maker. Hey. 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 Nice. Okay, like that. Here's your television across from your seating with your Furion uh, fireplace. 
And looks like your cabinet for your washer and dryer. Oh, what's this? Ah, nice pull-out pantry. Very nice. Nice. Hadn't nice. seen too many of those. It would oh, be nice very... if it was a little bit closer to the kitchen, but <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. It's close-ish. <laughs> and then this looks like a bath and a half model. This is a yeah, nice little half bath here. Oh, with some very nice uh, storage. So yeah, going into the master suite, queen size bed. He's in her closets. Hey. Two inch TV. And then you have your. Oh, your faux tile here, which looks very nice. I mean, this is this is a, a big shower. I mean. <laughs> This is a pretty big shower. You, you could probably get two people in here if you really wanted to, honestly. What do you think, Mika? Check that out. Oh, wow. Yeah. It is a big shower. That is a big shower, right? That's one of the biggest <laughs> RV showers I've seen. I mean, really. It really is. That is a big shower. And uh, here's your vanity area, cabinets, and your toilet. What do you think? It's interesting. It's pretty nice. Does this compare now? This does this compare to the Thor models that we saw? You know, at the same price point. In some aspects, but not all. Oh, okay. You heard it here, folks. You heard it here. Yeah. But you know, definitely something to consider. Um, but you know. <laughs> The, the space that those opposing, sl opposing slide outs give you is just really next level to me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, Thor has done a good job with the opposing slide outs. So, not to say that there is not a, uh, a J. Cole model that has opposing slide outs. We just not have, we have not seen it yet. Okay, so in keeping with our theme, we are here looking at the Integra Vision uh, Model 27A. This is a gas-powered Integra Ford V8. Here's a look from the outside. Now, of course, we have an Integra Class C, which we really love. Um, but in this video, we are looking at potentially the next rig being Class A. So we're looking at some gas-powered Class A's. This is the Vision MSRP 200 945 show price 149895 so yeah, $50,000 discount there that's good and here's your outdoor TV and a radio some speakers some slam latch uh, compartments here along the bottom and nice big awning over the top so let's go inside Well hey Miko Hello. Fancy meeting you here. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. So what do you think? It's a shorty. It's a shorty. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm so, just being honest. It's a shorty. Yeah. Not that much to it. So here's your interior cabin. Very similar to the uh, the Jayco's that we went into. Um, yeah. Here's your dinette. Looks like a uh, fold-out uh, sofa bed coming into the kitchen. A little U-shaped counter space here. Furion uh, three burner. The stove, a microwave, uh, RV refrigerator. Looks like a pantry here on the side. Yep. And okay, quite a bit of wardrobe space there. Yeah. Yeah. His Not and hers. Queen bed, and then even even have some wardrobe space over here with the big mirror. Oh yeah. Another wardrobe compartment there, which which is nice. You have your your master bedroom, his and hers, and then this could potentially be the wardrobe space for any guests that you have staying up front. Small TV on the wall there in the bedroom. And then this is a single bath right here in the back. 
Okay. Pretty similar to some of the Jayco models that we've seen, Mika. Yeah. And since I didn't see a TV anywhere, I was trying to figure out where it would be. I think the TV pops up here. Okay, that makes sense. Yep. So some space saving measures yep. there. So pop up TV right there. That would be right next to your dinette and right across from your sofa. Okay, let's look at another vision. Now this is a Vision 34G, uh, MSRP 232,356, show price 172,615. So this looks to be a little bit of an upgrade. Uh, nice paint on this model. Is your outdoor TV on a full wall slide out. Which is nice. Miko's opening up. Yep. Nice big storage compartment, slam latch doors. So not your uh, diesel pusher style compartment doors, but you know, your uh, more of your class class C style doors. Uh, but still, you know, big 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 compartments. Though. Big compartments. So. Let's check this out. All right. Here we go. Yeah, not me. I can definitely see the difference between this and the last one. Okay. It's a little more, you know, opposing slides, so you, you definitely have a lot more space. Now this this is a little strange here that the I don't know the. <laughs> The back of the sofa here is kind of right next to the heater, it's the, the fireplace, but you know. there's your dinette, theater seating, which is nice, electronic bunk overhead. Wow, these, these seats look super comfortable, I'll, I'll tell you <laughs> that. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah those very are some nice. Nice, uh, nice seats here, yeah, very nice seats. And there's a sofa bed. Yep, there's your pop-up big TV right there mm -hmm. behind your behind this couch. Um, so you only have one TV in this space. Um, sometimes wah, they wah, would actually wah. have. Yeah, sometimes they would actually put another TV right here, but instead they have uh, some storage space, which is always nice. And you do have the fireplace. And here is the kitchen. Three burner cooktop, stove, microwave, residential fridge, washer dryer, his and hers, wardrobe, 32 inch TV in the middle, and a nice big bed back here with some nice attic space overhead. And this is the bathroom. And oh, nice barn door, which is always a nice touch. I like that. Yeah, very cute. Mm -hmm. And no carpet. No carpet. No carpet. Yay. Yay. So we def definitely like the opposing slide concept. It makes this very spacious uh, theater seating along with your sofa. So, I mean, and, and, and really these all of these all of these dinettes basically convert also yep you can see the mechanism in the back so you have this dinette will convert to a bed this will probably convert to a bed yeah are I we thinking yes i would are think we... so yeah i would think so yeah and then of course the overhead loft too so <laughs> you can put a lot of people in here if you if you want to no, we don't want to. No, we don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> but we could. But we could. Okay. All right. Not too nice. bad. Not too bad. Good job, Integra. So Miko was about to go down to this one, and um, she had to put her square wheels on. Let's come back here to the gas-powered Class A's. <laughs> really? Really? That's what we're doing? That's what we're doing. So this is a, an Integra Emblem 36C. Uh, MSRP 247 236 show price 190 372
Let's check it out. Yeah, look at the, the baggage compartment. Yeah, thing. so here at the higher price, price point, you have more of the diesel pusher style compartments. Would, would you mind opening, opening that one right there in the middle? Sure. Yeah, so. Oh, yeah. Ooh, got a little, little carpet in here. But yeah, see, that goes all the way across to the other side. Yeah, these are nice, big storage bays here. Yeah. Very nice. And that, that, that the TV one is unlocked. Would you would you mind popping that up so we can look at the TV? The out, outdoor TV? Yeah, just should be unlocked. And you pull it down. You pull it down? Yeah, there you go. Pr press the button and pull that one down. There you go. And then just pull it up. Should be a gas spring or a gas yeah, struts. So. There you go. Nice. Okay. So we got a little uh, old school with the, <laughs> the radio. Looks like a, a CD, CD player or something. Probably not. <laughs> but you have speakers, you have your nice outlet TV. Yeah. Very nice. And of course, this is under a nice big awning right here. Oh, yeah. Yep. Very nice. So, yep, liking that. Let's go inside. Nice. Oh, Miko's happy already. <laughs> Me likey. Likey, likey. All right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Very, very spacious. Look at that. Yeah, this is nice. Okay. So we will start at the front. Yeah, front cab is pretty much the same. Once again, very, very nice. Yeah, th these are nice. Nice, comfortable seats here for the for your driver and your passenger driving down the road. Very nice seating. Got your overhead your overhead bunk that comes down. Here is your dinette. Uh, yeah, these are this is reclining uh, seating in this three seat arrangement. Yeah, which I like. That's yep. nice. And that middle one comes down for cup holders in USB outlets. Nice. Really like that a lot. That's pretty cool. And of course, those are your controls for your recliners on the two ends. And you have a nice fireplace and a that place for your Blu-ray player, sound bar with your TV. Or back to the kitchen, residential, big residential refrigerator. Oh, yeah. Uh, induction cooktop, nice. which of course gives you more cabinet space at the bottom, and a microwave. I don't really look too much of these sinks. It's, oh, yeah. So this is a nice farm sink, single basin deep farm sink. Nice. Yep. Pull that out. Spray down your veggies and stuff. <laughs> yeah, let's check out the back. So, that space for a stackable washer dryer there. Oh, Pull out okay. storage for your canned goods. And a little far from the kitchen, but not <laughs> that far. Yeah. Big uh, storage space right here, which. Washer dryer? Well, your washer dryer is actually down here. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it, oh, it's built in. Look, there it is. It's, hey. a, it's a combo unit. Nice. nice. Yeah, so it comes with a combo unit. So this is just extra storage. Linen closet. Linen closet or, you know, like we've mentioned. A closet for, for guests. Yeah, for, you know, because of course you have your dinette that does convert to a bed. You have the overhead uh, bunk that comes down. Mm -hmm. And so now... You have a nice big closet here, the area for your guests to put their clothes. This is a bath and a half model. Oh, so nice. Here is your half bath. Lots of good storage. See, that's your linen storage right there in this, in oh, this so half bath. Oh, so you don't need it. Okay. Yeah. That, that's your linen storage. Plenty of storage space there for your linen. Then you come into the master bedroom, big queen size bed. His and hers closets, 32 inch TV in the middle. And we come back to the 
master bathroom with the shower. And once again, this is one of these huge showers. Miko, can you model this? I mean, <laughs> this shower is really big. I mean, I, I'm, I'm trying to impress upon people how big this shower is for an RV. Or, well, I can I can get in the shower and you can film me. Either you know, how's that? <laughs> All yeah, right. You... So let's just see how big okay. is this shower. How big is this shower? All right. Whoa, this... that's a lot of space. Yeah, I mean, look at this. This is a lot of space. Yeah, this is a lot of space. Yeah, that's a lot of space. Yeah, I mean. All right. Uh, that seems like an invitation. <laughs> so here we both, yeah, are we both are in, in the, shower. the shower. Yeah. And there's, you know, still a good amount of room in here to move around. Yeah. Not bad. Not bad at Not all. Not bad at all. <laughs> Very good. Okay. I well, like it. I okay. like it. Yeah. With the little faux uh, uh, slate there. I like that. Yeah. Nice flooring. Like yep. that. Yeah. All right. The pocket door there for the bedroom. Yeah. Nice. And the half bath is still available. Yes. With that closed. So what do you think about this compared to the Thor that we looked at that you like? Um, I mean, I would definitely say uh, those two are kind of in the same realm. Yeah. I get the same kind of feel um, being in them. Yeah, I would have to agree. Mm -hmm. This this feels good. This feels good. Um, the only thing though is I really like the opposing the seating. You know, and having the two TVs. Yeah, and having the two TVs. Yeah. <laughs> Because here, That's the, only you, thing. the seating is a little limited in the fact that you probably can seat, you know, three comfortably, four, I would say max. Right. But that's, that's kind of about it. Yeah. And you have... I mean, the, the other one the is, is probably yeah. the same, So you, but you're all sitting together. And if you were trying to have a conversation that would be a little difficult because you know this is just for watching tv this is not for okay we're talking and you know we're being entertained yeah i, I feel like the other floor plan would be good if you were say traveling with other people you were going to an rv rally there were people that you knew and people actually came over to your coach and you were kind of entertaining what um as far as the other one yes the other floor. okay yeah this is yeah. like a family yeah this and is you're all just, watching tv yeah. together yeah it's kind of what i and feel you're just doing stuff together yeah yeah but you know it's um it's nice it is spacious yeah i like it i mean i like the long sofa because like if you wanted to lay long ways on the sofa oh, while yeah. you were watching Easily. tv yeah you would be able to do that definitely Please leave your comments below about these awesome 2023 motorhomes. Thanks so much for joining us on another Wander Open Roads adventure, and we will see you next time. Wander safely. Be sure to check out our selection of travel apparel at shopredsquare.com and our Etsy shop. Links will be in the description. Thank you.